So this question looks like it's going to be a diagram question. I say that because of the table that's provided here. So anytime we have a diagram question, what I suggest is that you take a look at the diagram before reading the question, just to get a sense of how things are organized, what information that diagram may contain. So for instance, in this particular table, it looks like we have two rows, uh, one for cats, one for dogs, and then uh, we have two columns. So dogs and cats that were fed only dry food versus dogs or cats that were fed both wet and dry food. Then we have our totals, right? So our last row is total. And our last column is also a total. So it seems pretty straightforward. Um, I also like a strategy that I call pinpoint method, which is if I can circle a number and be able to identify exactly what that number means, that's a good, a good sign that I actually understood how the information was presented. So this 23 here means that there are 23 dogs that are fed both wet and dry food. So again, pretty straightforward. So the question says, the table above shows the kinds of foods that are fed to the cats and dogs currently boarded at a pet, set, at a pet care facility. What fraction of the dogs are fed only dry food? All right, so a couple of things. What fraction of the dogs, right? So fraction means we know we're gonna have a fraction. So here's my fraction bar. So what fraction of the dogs? Well, how many dogs are there? There are 25 dogs, right? So if how many dogs there are? So how many, were, how many of those dogs were fed only dry food? Well, only two of them were. So two out of 25 must be my answer to this question.